Welcome from the Mobile Workers 2015. We have the Mi uh, Nokia Lumia 435. And actually, it's of course Microsoft Lumia now, as you can see here on top. And you can see it also here in the back. It says Microsoft since it was announced in January. And it's coming out now in March. And it's the cheapest Windows phone that you can buy right now. For Microsoft, at least. I don't know what the Chinese companies are doing, but we have here for just about 69 bucks a Windows phone that will actually even get an update um, to the um, Windows 10 ecosystem end of the year when that will come out because we have a 1 gig of RAM inside and a dual core Snapdragon 200 processor, which is, of course, also um, completely fast enough. Um, also, Intel, we have 8 gigs of um, memory, 1 gig of RAM, already mentioned that, and you can ex actually expand that also via micro um, SD with not only 32 gigs maximum, but 128 gigs if you would want that. Then you have here on and on sw on and off switch here, volume rockers, speaker on the bottom, micro USB, and on top you have your 3.5mm headphone jack. Um, on the front, of course, you have your, obli uh, your obligatory Windows buttons where you can, for example, start a Bing search, and then you can also, um, for example, see here how the keyboard looks like which is really quite nice for typing quickly typing it's hard to miss any letters and it's also really quick when it comes to just here moving around with an animation even though we have here the cheapest and actually it should be the slowest windows phone on in our hands and i'm just too stupid to hit the buttons if you're wondering why it doesn't work sometimes i am just not used to and why is it oops sorry so this is probably the show effect, the screen sometimes doesn't want to move, so here we go. So you have also the feature that you can double tap to unlock of course, and then do this. And then we can also try the camera, where we have a VGA camera on the front, which you will see in a second, I think, and a 2 megapixel camera on the back, which is enough, but of course, for a cheap phone, you can't expect much of a um, phone camera here. And let me just turn that around, front facing VGA right there. Fast enough, but the display is also not the best for looking at nice pictures. And uh, as I said already, I think on the back we have a five uh, two megapixel camera with no flash, and you can actually take off the back, so you can also see that this is also available as a dual SIM device. I think for India or some other countries like that, that would be interesting. Come on, and you can of course also change then the uh, back covers. You would want different colors, like for example a green one like that. This is for example the 532. Um, which has almost the same specs, but of course a little bit better screen, uh, better cameras, and a little bit of a higher price, but not much higher. So if you take off the back, you can see here the removable battery, which has 1560 milliamp, the micro SD card slot, and here your two SIM cards that you can of course exchange after you remove the battery, which I will of course not do right now. We put this back in, and then we already finished with our first hands-on here of the uh, Microsoft Lumia 435, the cheapest Windows phone by Microsoft out right now. Thank you for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe. Till next time, tune in again, and thank you much for watching.